industries since April. Well, if you're on the job hunt or you work in a high demand industry, don't be surprised if you get a text from a recruiter. More companies are searching for talent via text messaging, and Annie Taylor shows us how to handle messages like this. Even for those of us who are pretty connected to technology and phones, a text about a job might catch us by surprise. First thought probably is whether it's a scam, but in many cases, it's likely legitimate. Recruiters are using texting to set up interviews for a number of jobs, including pilots and nurses. Companies like Whole Foods, UPS, and Ford are texting potential candidates through the text recruit technology. Now, Dan Ryan works with companies across the country, helping hire top talent and some of the most in-demand industries. He's been using text as a way to connect with the potential new hires for years now. If I'm texting somebody for the first time, I'm always going to include my name. And in many cases, I'm also going to put in my email address. Now, Ryan encourages people who are text recruited to do a little homework of their own. Verify who they're texting with or the company they're texting about. You can do that by visiting a company's website or looking for the person on LinkedIn. You could also make a simple phone call. I think the responses have been overwhelmingly positive and people respond quickly. They'll tell me a better way to reach them. But I, I think people like to communicate by text Okay, but don't be surprised if you are chatting with a live person at first. Some companies start with a computer service that connects you to the right hiring manager or recruiter once you respond.